there, Alaskans, wherever you are. Welcome to the Must Read Alaska Show. Coming to you from somewhere in Alaska. This is the place where we talk about, you guessed it, Alaska. Where we keep the mainstream media on their toes and where we are standing up for what's right in a world run by leftists. You can find out more by heading over to mustreadalaska.com and also checking out the Must Read Alaska YouTube channel for some really great content. But first, let's get this party started. Well, welcome everybody to the Must Read Alaska show. I'm your host, John Quick, and uh, I want to thank everybody for tuning in today. I'm going to cut straight to the point today because we have a very exciting guest. We have Mayor Charlie Pierce with us today. And um, now I might be a little biased because I've worked for Mayor Pierce and I'm, I'm good friends with the Mayor, Mayor Pierce, but he has been a f- phenomenal mayor here for us on the Kenai Peninsula and probably is going to go down as probably the most conservative mayor in the Kenai Peninsula history. He's curved budgets. Um, he's managed the borough better than any other mayor that I can think of. And he's also running for governor. He got top four in our brand new ranked choice voting system, which is a huge accomplishment. He was endorsed by the Republican Party as well. Welcome to the Must Read Alaska show. Mayor Pierce, I heard you have some exciting news to share with us. Yeah, thank you, John. Um, you know, we have been campaigning very hard, and, and, uh, and you know, let me first and foremost say that it's been an honor to serve as mayor of the Kenai Peninsula Borough, and I, I, I am humbled and, and uh, I'm very gracious for having the opportunity to have done that. But today I have uh, to uh, deliver a message to uh, the residents of the borough and, and to Alaska that, uh, you know, it's, it's uh, I, I mentioned that if I'd gotten in the top four that I would move on to go campaign, and, and today I'd like to read a letter to you if I may, and and just share the news with folks. Uh, This letter is addressed to Brent Johnson. He's the assembly president. And uh, my letter reads, uh, Dear Mr. Johnson, I am writing to tender my resignation as mayor of the Kenai Peninsula Borough. This letter is not intended to become effective until 5 p.m. on Friday, September 30th of 2022. As you know, I'm currently in the midst of a gubernatorial uh, campaign. Given the results of the primary election, it is clear that I cannot simultaneously discharge the duties of this office and run a competitive campaign for governor. So I have decided to resign in order to campaign full time. It has been an honor and a privilege to serve as mayor, and I look forward to hopefully continuing that service as Alaska's next governor. So I'm going to go campaign, and, uh, you know, it was my... uh, campaign team's desire to for me to do this much earlier but I, again um, putting a plan together and and uh, I will help through the transition um, they'll have to select a, a new mayor maybe an appointment a short-term appointment and then code requires a, uh, a, a special election because I have one year left on my on my term as mayor so they'll, we'll have a special election I would assume and I certainly want to assist in making sure that the, the duties and the business of the people continues to take place uh, with, uh, without any hiccups or any uh, delays. And so we're going to help with that transition. And, and I'm excited and I'm ready to go campaign. Well, that's awesome. I know that you've left the borough better than you found it. And you also have um, some phenomenal staff at the borough. I remember a meeting that you and I had early on where... Um, you know, first your first week on the job, and uh, the chart showed that the budget was plummeting off a cliff. We are going to lose all of our fund balance. We're going to have to raise taxes on everybody. None of that happened. T- tell us a little bit about a couple of your accomplishments that you were um, you've been most proud of over the last five years. Well, if you recall that that first budget we were um, challenged with is that we were supposed to deficit spend about. $4.5 million that fiscal year. And what you and I did is, is at, after eight months spent $434,000 in deficit spend. So we didn't do all of that by ourselves. Of course, we got some extra money, pill money, and we've got some uh, revenue sharing from the state that we, we had not anticipated. But we did pick up about $1.7, $1.8 million worth of savings. And what you and I did is we put a hiring freeze on, if you'll recall, and we did a travel freeze. And we went inside and we really built a team of individuals that 
uh, really took ownership and the credit goes to the employees of the borough, clearly. They are the ones that went in and recognized where they could find savings and they did it. So here's where we leave it. Here's how I leave it. And this, this let the record reflect that today the, the borough is sitting on $30 million worth of fund balance. Uh, we just lowered the mill rate two tenths of a mill and uh, the revenue forecast is positive for the next two fiscal years. Uh, schools are funded to the cap uh, for the next two years and uh, 2024 and 2025 uh, no mill rate increases uh, are, are called for. And so, you know, unless you have a, a huge disaster, this borough's in, in, in very sound shape. And, and uh, I'm, I'm proud to say that we are leaving it better than we found it. And uh, uh, again, the credit goes to the borough employees. Well, Mayor Pierce, thank you so much for sharing this news with us. I think you're going to be wise to hit the campaign trail full time and uh, no new taxes, $30 million in the bank, actually lowering people's taxes and um, having a great set of employees to help you do that. You can't go wrong with that. Thank you so much, Mayor Pierce, for serving the Kenai Peninsula for the last five years. You were the guy that said, we're open for business and everybody's essential. And I think that most politicians in Alaska wish they would have said that. You're the guy that said it. And so... Be proud of that. We'll see you on the campaign trail. And for everybody listening, watching, and reading, thank you so much for being a part of this. Do you want to send us off with any last words, Mayor Pierce, before we head off here? Good luck to all the candidates, and, and I look forward to uh, visiting with folks and and uh, um, campaigning. We're, uh, uh, we're, we're excited. Awesome. Thank well, thank you so much, Mayor Pierce. Everybody out there listening, feel free to click uh, the uh, review button. Give us a five-star review. And uh, thank you. Uh, we'll see you again on Monday uh, morning. And until next time from Somewhere Alaska, I'm John Quick signing off here.